So now the question is, what can you do with Charles? Well, um, in the beginning, not so much. Like for example, if I take my own app and I search something, you can see here that if I don't use SSL proxying, then I can see nothing, it's all garbage. And what you want is to really see the JSON response. So in order to make that work, you have to go to proxy, SSL proxying settings, and then you have to um, put in the domains where you want to use SSL proxying. Uh, and Charles, because of the certificate, will then be able to translate that from the garbage to something useful. Don't know if I'm explaining this correctly, but that's the end result, basically. Of course, I don't know which domains you need, so you have to figure that out yourself. Maybe ask your uh, teammates what would be useful domains. Also, take note that some of the domains I have here use a wildcard in some places. So yeah, this is a step you have to figure out by yourself. But the end result is that if you search something, so let's search something else, that I will be able to see what the backend gives me back. And this is information that's hopefully useful to you. And you can even do more amazing things with that, um, namely intercepting the call or giving a mock response back, which we can look at later. That's it for this step.